Um, we'll see what happens. So, alright guys, we're ready to rock and roll. Re ready to walk and roll? Ready to walk and roll? Wee wee. Your wedges are ready? <laughs> <laughs> Wobby! <laughs> Um, who the fuck is not started? I don't know, who would do that, right? I know, I know. There's your answer. Shared unit <laughs> control on. <laughs> who, who would not put shared units on? Like, why would they just not do that every game? Yeah, I don't know. It just, it, I don't know who the hell would do that. They'd have to be insane to not do that. Jeez, a lot of, um, a lot of bases on this map. For the size Echo of LE, yeah, it's an interesting map, isn't it? So, um... What have we got? We got a Terran versus Zerg, so I'll get um, you know who to introduce the Zerg and and the other one to introduce well, the other Voldemort. one. Voldemort. Voldemort, yeah. Right so this is three guys one replay, we're into a, another exciting well probably like it's gonna be a shit one v one, let's just put it out there. Let's not get the expectations too high. It's a one v one. Could be really good, could be really shit, but we'll see what happens. Up in the top left hand corner, um oh, I'm Smithy by the way. I'm Ella Murray. But I'm Bart. Let's introduce the player, shall we? In the top left-hand corner of the blue Zerg, we have Las Vegas's shittier, lesser, well-known cousin, Reno. Reno. Oh, yeah. And bottom right-hand corner. And the bottom right, playing for no re. It is, oh, my God, Dinosaur. Oh, my God, Dinosaur. Oh, my God, Dinosaur. Um, right, so this is another in, um, really, really, really exciting Zerg versus... Terrence, so oh you sound it oh i'm 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 a mate like I'm, I'm already like look at that overlord man look at that overlord moving look at it it's fucking amazing ready for shitty trivia shitty trivia time all right what do we got is the utility an australian design the, the, car. the what the utility the, yeah. oh you mean the ute i i mean the ute is I'm it gonna say no design? i'm gonna say yes if no, where's it from? America. Um, Correct. The answer is yes. The answer is yes. Well, what, what, what answer is that then? The answer is yes. <laughs> the answer it is it is an Australian. Design. Oh, it is an Australian design. Oh, okay. it's an Australian design. There you go. Now, well, see, I I thought it was too because I remember reading something about um, was it Holden or someone? They had the had Rusty these... Holden Ute. You yes, know? Right. Yeah, that's right. They had they had the the um, the cars and they. Um, what had happened was um, they got feedback because they, they tried to um, launch some to a certain type of vehicle and people were like, oh, I need something to have stored stuff in the back or something. And uh, based on that feedback, they, they did this, made this Australian ute. And they put There's the one thing Australians do. It's drive. Yeah, they, they Australian, drive. Australians drive. They drive, yes. They do they drive. really, though? Like... Well, they do. Some, some I, try I, to. I guess, I, guess, I guess quite a lot of Australian population live in in the city in the metropolitan areas oh yeah because there's long yeah yeah I, I get what you're saying yeah yep. but like in between that they'll just drive that's what they do yeah so oh my god dinosaur doing pretty good he's got his um uh, reactor down factory he's gonna go some hell in her ass and it's pretty good timing because the zerg is gonna get an expansion and doesn't have a pool oh now he's now he's got his pool getting his queen so i think if he gets out a couple of fast hellions and does a good job with them I'm almost certain he's going to get some decent kills out of it, but um, time will tell momentarily. So, the Zerg does see it, by the way. His Overlord has made the base. He knows exactly what's coming. Alrighty, are we ready for another question in Shitty Trivia? Oh, oh. <laughs> How many countries are larger than Australia? How, How many, many countries, countries are larger than Australia? Bonus points if you get the name of the country. Well, Russia, Russia. is obviously yeah, one. Yeah. Um, uh, the question is, is the United States bigger as a country no, it's not. than Australia? No. You don't, don't no. think so? Canada might be, though. Canada is pretty big. But is it... Is it? Well, I don't know. I, I actually say the United States is bigger than Canada in physical space. 
I mean, because particularly global warming and stuff, like Canada's pretty much just melted by now. So it's difficult because in a two D map, Canada looks fucking huge, but it's a globe, right? So that sort of yeah. shit curls up all together. Oh, it's, right. like, it's like fucking Greenland on those certain maps. Mm. Greenland mm. looks fucking huge. Greenland looks amazing. Yeah, yeah. but no. You, I'll give you a hint. I'll give you a hint. Greenland is not bigger than Australia. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for that. There's your hint. Greenland is um, not. Greenland all right, so, is not so I'm going to go. I'm going to go three other countries bigger than Australia. Do we know the number? Well, you don't. Oh, I'll give you the number. I'll give you the number. I was going to say the number camping. is five. There are five really? countries that are bigger than Australia. Well, it's got to be ones? Russia for sure. Russia. Yeah, well, Russia's obviously in the list. I'm going to say United States. It is five. There has to be so Russia, United States. We got some Maybe Hellions India in. might be a little bit bigger. We got some Hellions. Oh, yeah, the Hellions. Yeah, so Hellions. There is a StarCraft game playing. <laughs> oh, yeah, I feel about that. <laughs> Yeah, so the Hellions did a little bit, but um, they came a little bit too late to the party. Banshee following up, that's a good idea. The Banshee Aras will be pretty effective. Um, Lings are going to come in and kind of try and do some damage. Uh, I don't think they're going to be effective because there is a wall in place. And there are mines in place as well. Watch the mines. Let's just look. I'm, just, I'm zoomed right into the mines. Oh my god, dinosaur. Oh my god, Ling Dad. Hashtag. <laughs> Bang! And still some alive. Could have spread them out a bit more, I think. I think so. I think you're right. I think I need to spread them out a little bit more. Um, so so there, are, there are five countries bigger than Australia. What are they? There are definitely five cunts bigger than Australia. Um, so, uh, Russia... I'm going to say, I'm going to say Russia. Well, what's a big... India. Uh, no. I'm going to say Russia, or, India, no, in, India, United no. States. I didn't think China was, was, was bigger. I don't think... I'm going to say maybe not China, but it could be. Um, possible. Um, the ones in the Mediterranean are all pretty small. Yeah. The, um, and maybe somewhere in South Africa, maybe. But maybe, maybe, maybe Brazil. Uh, Brazil's pretty small. Oh, what well, about Antarctica? That's not really a country, though, is it? Like? Oh no, they would. They would include Antarctica as a country, wouldn't they? I bet you they would. Just Antarctica to be smart, Antarctica is not included. Well, oh, well, okay. And if it is, it's it's not on the list. Okay. So I'm going to go United States, Russia. China, India, and uh, Egypt, maybe? Nah, no, no, Egypt's way too small. Wait a minute. No, so I'm trying to find something somewhere down south there that could be... Is it like some trick question where it's like actually Great Britain because they've got all these colonies all over the world <laughs> that counts to them it's there? It's not a trick thing. question. It's not a trick question. I, I don't know what... Honestly, I have no idea what the fifth one is, but I, I'm just going to put it out. I'm going to say Russia definitely... China. What's well, so, okay? Let's go. Russia, China, Canada. Um, yeah, Russia, China, Canada, India, and um, what was the other one I said? That was it. I don't know. Russia, China, United States, Canada, India. There we go. That's that's my five. Russia, China, United States, Canada. Russia, China, United States, Canada, India. Way, one of one of those is wrong. One of those is wrong. Probably India. What's No, uh, India's pretty big. Yeah, but more mind damage. Bang. Oh, what about like, Ooh. 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 Eighteen Definitely kills. Population, but, but no way in land mass. Twelve kills on the other mine as well. By the way, Starcraft. So, um, <laughs> massive amounts. Yeah, yeah was, I was watching it. It was, <laughs> no, no, it was awesome. I mean, that was a really cool. That was actually the most exciting thing I've seen all night. Like, and that, I know that's not saying much, but for these games, but yeah, that was. You want, cool. you want to know the answers? Yeah, yes, you you've, you've said all five countries. Oh well, we have Russia, we have the answer then, don't we? Yeah. Russia, Canada, yep. China, USA. Brazil. Oh, it was is Brazil. Brazil. Yeah. It was Brazil. It was Brazil. Lee, I didn't think Brazil was bigger than Australia. I never thought mm. that was bigger than Australia. Brazil's a big country. It's a big it's country. A big mm. And we're chopping it all down. So <laughs> fuck you, Brazil. That's right. So well, they, they, <laughs> that, 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 that one Brazilian subscriber we had, we just lost him. Lost Thanks for that. Thanks <laughs> <laughs> for Ash going on the third here for the... Um... It's a stupid place to arrest the But now he knows the bench is there. He's going to get ready for it. He should have moved it on in and done, put it somewhere else. But oh, well, he might actually get that. There are sport crawlers everywhere else. I think that was like really the, the best option. You know what? 
I, I think you're right. I mean, he probably could have got the gas in the natural, maybe. Um, he will actually probably get this. It looks like. Is there any anti air flip for the Zerg? No, there's not. Apart from the. Uh, his, his, his spire is almost done. He's got a Hydra then, but there's no Hydras coming out. No, there's no Hydras coming out. His spire is almost done, but so he's going to get meters. It looks like this hatchery is going to go down, or is he going to cancel? That's the question. Oh, by the way, more links. And they're dead. Canceling is a, a, a smart call. Oh, he cancelled. Wow. I think the, it was a smart call. No, oh, it was. It was. It was the right call. He delayed that banshee from stupid amounts of time. Let's see how many kills our mines are up to now. Um, I'm trying to get on the, zoom in on that other mine. Or is there only one mine there now? And that and that bit there. Oh no, there it is. Banshee's done a bit of harassing the queens, but it's not really going to help him much. Mines have done damage on these. Uh, 13 kills Mine's for doing one. damage on, on the Overseer? Five to the other. They did. They sure did. They've wow. come back home. Yeah, they're heading back home. There's a serious amount of kills with those mines. Those mines are racking up kills. If we look at the units lost tab, fairly even. We've got two meters on the way. The meters are just hanging out. Banshee's cloaked. They were obviously trying to kill the Banshee. They've failed on that one. And that's probably why the uh, Overseer is coming back for the Banshee. Now we're seeing some Hydras, but like... It's a bit late, mate. Bit late, mate. To the you lost. Party. You lost your third. That's right. You lost it. Let's put him back down again. You lost the game. You lost the game. GG. Oh fuck <laughs> <laughs> He was going for a fourth, but the uh, drone dies. No reaction. So what else is happening? Not much. All right, we ready for another episode of Shitty Trivia? Get my Shitty Trivia on. Go what for was, it. What was Sir Donald Bradman's batting average? 99.96? Or was it 9.4? No. 99.94. It's 99.94. Uh, yeah, oh, geez. wow. You're on to it. Hey, you were so on to that. <laughs> what, how, how do you know that? Like, it's just a... I've done a lot of trivia. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> it, it, that, that's, that's actually, a, a, I don't want to say fairly common, but it pops up from time to time, to old Donny. Because what happened was he didn't get a batting average of 100 because in his very last game, he got a duck. Oh, that fucked up his average. Sure well, did. Wow. That's, that, is, that would piss me off big time. Mm. If I if I had been going, I had a massive awesome career. Then I'm a lot. Holy shit! You know what also pissed me off? Like a hundred lings. That would piss me off too. So, um, which I think actually, I, I actually think that is close to a hundred lings. Look at the units tab. Um, is right. it, sorry, sixty lings. My bad. So that's still a lot of lings. Um, Thirteen muters as well. Mm. And uh, one, two, three, four, what five bases all up? To the three of the Terran. I'm almost gonna call it now and say the Zerg's probably going to win. Uh, if, but if, 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 if I don't the know. Terran can strike now, they'll be okay. But mm. letting those bases get saturated is, is a poor decision. Oh, absolutely. You know, like, and I mean, it's. <laughs> I mean, the other thing also that we the, it's, it's worthy of sort of mentioning. Because we have noticed as well with the, the Zerg, his, his Micro hasn't been that crash shot. He's literally headbutted his lings into the into the uh, frying pan a number of times. So, you know, I mean, and obviously when you, in games like this where you've got a lot of army on the line, like it, it can come down mm -hmm. to some of those simple decisions. So <sighs> it'll be interesting to see what happens. But the, the Terran is definitely way behind. So if he, if he gets a poor engagement, he's not going to come back from it. Um, so we'll have to see whether the oh my god dinosaur uh, is is he ready for another episode of shitty trivia? Or will he become extinct? Hopefully, like I'm always anyway. ready for shitty trivia. Alrighty, this is a two-part question. Okay. Oh, two parts. Name Australia's most eastern point and most western point. Byron Bay is eastern. Yeah, we obviously know that. Um, What's Australia's most western point? Uh, port. Port Headland? No. no, no. Port Headland. Not a port. Not a port. Uh, it's uh, not not a uh, broom. Oh, no. um, I wouldn't fucking know how you learn. Oh, wait, but does it include the islands as well? No. Obviously, it doesn't. Because otherwise yeah, because it's fucking Christmas Island. Christmas, would be like, yeah. 
the eastern points out. Um, hmm. I, I, I'm, I'm, I have a gut feeling I know. Like I've heard someone's told me what the most westerly point is before, and I'm just when I say it, you'll be like, ah, oh, okay. Um, can I find oh. a friend? <laughs> we could have one to All start. Friends are online. <laughs> 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 um, Do they happen to live over in Western Australia? I was, I was just going to call you. Like, <laughs> just, <laughs> and your phone rings like, hello? <laughs> um, oh, shit. What is it? I, 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 I pass. I get no. No. That's uh, I, I don't pass. Let me Google it. <laughs> <laughs> You don't know that's okay. It's not the end of the world. Oh, it could be. How do you know that? <laughs> um, Actually, if it's the end of the world, it's a good place to go. You need the no ocean. The most westerly like, point you're, you're is... Western Australia, so no one else is there. We got a bit of action going on. That the Zerg's moving in. Steep point, it's called. You googled it, you bastard. I did not. I I, I have amazing recollection. <laughs> I, I just I just mashed ours in my head and it came Steep out. Steep Point, Shark Bay, and Cape Byron are the answers. What about the most northerly point? Cape York. It is Cape York. What's that, that's like point? a landmass. It's not really like a town or something. It's like saying New South Wales is the most easterly point because that's where Byron is. Like, oh, I think Cape York's a uh, little more. I think Cape York is actually a proper location. Okay, I mean, say, say like the. Oh, north by the way, death in the. Uh, a lot of mutants. There's a lot of mutants. A lot of thaws, but those thaws will absolutely annihilate those mutants. If they engage it head on, it's going to be a bad day for that Zerg army. But look he's... look at this Zerg army in the middle of the field. They are captivated by those debris. Oh, it's like, amazing. It's like absolutely all the rocks. captivated. Like, look, look at that. <laughs> like, wow. Rocks. Look at that debris. So much potential. Well, so, yeah. These mutants are, are going to have a bad day. Oh, oh. wow. Yeah, no, that's... Mutants engaging Thors is not a good choice. Okay, the, ar the army does finally decide to join, um, and join the party, but that is not the greatest engagement. That is going to be massive, that's going to be like that. Um, they're held back to doing a pretty damn good job. And that plant three fortune in the tanks, that is a serious... Oh. Like, he literally headbutted into death. The only thing that ne they needed to kill there was the Thors, that's the only thing they did to kill. Pretty much. And I mean, I mean, you know, they had the tanks, had the siege mode, um, and combined with the Hellbats and the Thors, that did a, a beautiful job there. If you look at the units lost, he's going to be way behind. Um, We're still seeing even army supply. The mm. Zergs, well, because the Zergs, Zergs a bit Zergs behind. Zergs has better macro overall. But the Zergs a bit behind in, in resources. Yeah, but his army composition shit. Well, he's, he's spending his resources. The Terran isn't. It? Um, a lot Same of Hydras. Base, but so what? Mm. I don't agree with the Hydras. I think the Hydras will get wiped with this army. I think you need a few more Roach because obviously it's a mech-based army. Mm -hmm. Now I don't think he's producing Roach, uh, Roach is he? No, he's not. He needs he's producing ult. more Hydras. So, I think pretty much just by pure unit composition, it's not going to end well. Hydras are not going to be good No, absolutely not. There goes the Hydras. They're pretty much all down. So unless he gets serious, he's building 19 Hydras, so I, I'm just going to say it's game over right now. Does he even have a Roach Warren? He doesn't. Really? No Roach Warren. So um, this is pretty much GG. This this army will eventually move in, and the dinosaur will live to die another day. Um, those sea tanks are going to get a few hits before they die, but it, just, it doesn't matter at this point. Um, it's over. There is no way that the uh, Zerg is coming back from this. Pretty much, we can just sit back and enjoy the uh, enjoy the death and do any more shitty trivia. Yeah, oh yeah, Are you ready for some shitty trivia? Yeah. I'm gonna actually Google that as well. Shitty trivia question ever. <laughs> Shitty. Trivia. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Yeah. Australia has the world's largest sand island. Fraser Island. Um. Yep. Okay. So, what animal is on the Western Australian Dingo. flag? <laughs> oh. Sorry. <laughs> no. 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 It's not what animal. Uh, it's the black swan, isn't it? It is the black swan. Holy yeah. shit! Can you go three for three? Here we go. In what city 
did the Australian Commonwealth Parliament first sit? Oh, what city? Tenerfield. Both incorrect. Um, oh, well, Australian Sydney then. Commonwealth? What city did the Commonwealth Parliament first sit? Melbourne? Correct. Oh, yeah, because that's why Canberra is built, because it's halfway between Melbourne and Sydney. And they're like, wow, yeah. we want to be the capital. No, we want to be the capital. Neither are you going to be the capital. It's pretty much the typical... Um, All right, here we go, here we go. The final point, question, right. the final question. Who is on the front of the current issue $100 note? Ah, uh, so John Monash. No. What? The current $100 note. Mm-hmm. Um, it's not Monash. Fuck I off. I, I don't know. If it's not, I, thought, I would have thought Monash would have been my first guess too. I really got no idea. Maybe the, maybe this question's out of date. How, how long ago did that? How long oh, is, ago is, that is, is it Morton, um, Mor Morrison? No. Not someone Morrison? No. George Washington. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Something's fucking going weird there because it's... Oh, they're of the more uh, feminine persuasion. The Australian oh, really? hundred dollar note. Yep. No. Um, I got no idea. Is the audience going to answer? Find a friend. No, my housemate's not answering. <laughs> I can hear him going off the. You know that question before. Um, Dame Nelly Melba. No fucking way! No, no, no! That's that's a troll. That's not that can't How be How many real. times have you seen a pineapple lately? Come on, oh, I've I see, I see him a bit through work. Yeah, um, not as common as the fifty, but you, you always get them when you don't need them. Oh, not, not pineapple! Oh, mate. come on! It fucking is John Monash, but he's on the other side, so it's sort of like. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yeah, Dame, Dame Nellie Melba. Yeah, she was an opera singer, right? Yeah, yeah, she dominates. Mm. All right, so I'm going to give you the ultimate shitty trivia question. All right. Um, speaking of domination. Yep. Um, so uh, the question is, how long does a pig's orgasm last? Six to eight hours. Uh, it's, a little bit, it's less than that. Four hours. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's, it's less than that. I mean, you're gonna be realistic about it. So, how but much half uh, half research have you done this? <laughs> half a second. <laughs> no, it, no, it, no, it's, it's, it's more one. than you. Surely it's a long one. <laughs> Twenty minutes. Hi. <laughs> thirty minutes. <laughs> it's thirty minutes. Thirty minutes. A, a half pig's an orgasm, hour orgasm lasts for thirty minutes. Um, apparently. <laughs> the question I just, I'm really uh, so uh, um, blah blah pigs pig is on the last of three minutes. Haven't been able to find any credible sources to confirm or refute this. Um, <laughs> I've been thinking about pig orgasms a lot lately. In my experience, a boar boar's orgasm lasts 14 minutes. Right. So what was anyway, so apparently pigs last 30 minutes. An orgasm. That I mean, obviously they last longer than that if it takes you 30 I mean you know if, if it takes you 30 minutes if you can have a 30 minute orgasm it must be a pretty good lead up you think maybe it's just all orgasm like the entire time they're just having sex coming <laughs> and, and sex lasts for 30 minutes and it's just like hey they come the entire time and it's how, fucking how, how about we how about we look at well, let's, let's have a look hang on um, <laughs> well, look, I'm going to I'll, I'll ask this question now and I'll find out the answer while I'm typing it so, so which animal has the longest orgasm I don't want that in my search history. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, know, you know the NSA records everything, right? Everything. Oh, well, uh, uh, yep. <laughs> everything. <laughs> um, say that, but there are a lot of famous people out there, and we haven't seen their search histories yet. So one's functional they care about my search history. Yeah, it's a good know. point. Five longest orgasms ever recorded. Okay, well, let's, let's have just a look. have more trivia. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the game finished, by the way. <laughs> what, what animal? What animal so, was yeah. on the two cent coin in Australia? Uh, frilled neck lizard. Frilled yep. neck lizard is correct. That's right. 
Fucking nailing these. Keep them you, coming. You don't want to, Well, they're all they're all Australian based. Yeah. Okay, here we go. Who is the only person to have been awarded both the Australian of the Year and the Young Australian of the Year titles? Oh, Kathy one Freeman. person that's got them both. Fuck. Kathy um, Freeman. Kathy Freeman is correct. Oh, really? Good. Yep. Honor. Good honour. She dominates. Yeah. Running around doing shit. Yeah. Fucking yep. Get into it. All right. Which which animal has the longest tail? Snake. <laughs> no, no. They are a tail. <laughs> <laughs> Just one big long tail. Just the head on the end. <laughs> oh, it'd be something it's, like... It's, it's, um, snake isn't correct, by the is, way. Is, is it a male? Is it a, is it a mammal? With, like, those, like, fucking monkeys, those fucking sick long tails like and shit? Like a lemur or something. Um, no, it, it is a male. It has the longest tail. Male? Male or mammal? Mammal. Mammal's what I meant to say. Is it a mammal? Oh, okay. Uh, if I, I think it is. Pretty sure they're pretty sure they're mammals. I don't even know. Yeah, they have to be mammals. Yeah, of course they're warm blooded. They would be warm blooded. Well, that doesn't determine if it's a mammal. <laughs> I know, but 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 like, it, and, and it's got to be of a certain like, yeah. All right, well, uh, no, they, they are mammals. They're mammals. They're mammals. Any 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 guesses? No. I'm a super oh, army. <sighs> <laughs> the Alami is yeah. my answer. Yes, he okay. has Lock it in. <laughs> the animal with the longest tail also has a pretty long neck. The male giraffe has a longer tail than the female. The male's tail can grow up to an incredible eight feet in length. So wow. there you go. I would. I, 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 I wouldn't wow. have picked that either. Yeah. yeah. I would not have picked that. So. Um, so right. I'm going to just look right. up which here's, animal here's, has the shortest and see what comes up in Google. Here's, here's some more. Here's some more Australian trivia. Ned Kelly. Bit of an oh, icon. Oh, Keza. Yeah. Where was his last stand? Fucking in New South Wales or Victoria in the bush somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it was Glen Rowan. It was Glen Rowan. It was, it was, it was Rowan. It was yeah, 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 there you go. It worked. Thank oh, you. Sucks. I was there. Mm -hmm. Shot the bastard myself. Mm -hmm. um, yeah. I'll, I'll give you a question. So, what animal has the shortest lifespan? A fly? Some sort of I, I need more information. B butterfly? What type of fly? Oh, I don't know. Housefly. Fly. Louis the fly. Um. It is the mayfly. The adult female of the species lived less than five minutes. Wow. That is a really shit. How, adult do, they even, male. how do they reproduce? I, <laughs> really quickly. Quick. <laughs> Fucking quick is how they do it. <laughs> No, wait, that is amazing, but isn't it? I mean, you think about it—a mayfly, so you, your whole life lasts five minutes. Like that is just fucking. No, no, that's not the whole life. It's just when they're in the in the fly stage. You don't have a pupa and a maggot stage. Oh, right? I, I, I guess maybe they're yeah. reproducing those stages. It's okay. Yeah, uh, may, maybe. Um, so, so by the time they get to um the fly stage, they're probably like you know the equivalent of someone here who's old. Like, really? You think so? Yeah. Okay, well, all right, do you have any more trivia? We'll do, we'll yeah, do. oh, yeah, there's more. Okay, <laughs> but wait, there's, <laughs> more. there's more. In in what year In what year was the decimal currency introduced in Australia? 1966. Oh, we had that already. The, um, <laughs> wait a minute. Okay. I'm gonna, I'm Such a nub. Has... Are we going to finish this video or just keep Oh, it? yeah, maybe I should at some point. <laughs> finish it up um, and we'll just put one up of just trivia. All right. <laughs> That's what we should do. Um, all right. Okay. Well, let me just do one more. I'll yeah. just do one more of these ones. So, um, all right. So, oh, fucking thing. Hang on a sec. Um, Hang on a sec. Waiting for it to load. Um, basically, the question is, which animal has the shortest memory? Goldfish? It's not a, it's not a goldfish. That's a fucking misleading thing. I don't know. Humans. <laughs> no, so um, the memory. So, uh, okay, so, well, I, I can like give a you a clue. Second fish or something? I can, yeah, I can give you a clue. It, it, it doesn't swim. So, 
Mm. I'm going to say it's the fucking Mayfly. It's only around for five minutes. <laughs> That's true, isn't it? I mean, its memory's not going to be that long. If you're going to be dead in five minutes... How well memory. can they test all these memories of animals? Like, I question that... Well, <laughs> so, I, well, I don't know. Well, anyway, all right, here's, here's the official answer anyway. So, it has been a long-time myth that goldfish have the shortest me attention memory span, mm -hmm. but their memory can span up to three months, as, and they're even known to be able to recognise time. Hamsters are now considered to have one of the shortest hamsters. memory spans. So, apparently hamsters. So, there you go. I, I would never have thought of that, but but that's that's how it is. So, um, so we better finish off this video. Before I we guess, do, before, before we do, can okay. you tell me who was the most recent Australian to win the men's singles at Wimbledon? Pat Rafter. Oh. <laughs> it's not. It's not. Late Pat it's the come Parker. on, dude. Yeah, it is the Hewitt. come on, dude. It's it's Leighton Hewitt. Yeah, it's Hewitt. Leighton Hewitt. Yep. No, I didn't know he was that good. Hell yeah, he, 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 he was. He, he had a brief period where he was good. A brief period, like a Mayfly period. <laughs> 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 oh dear. Just just enough to get in there. Yeah. <laughs> just enough to get in there and reproduce again. <laughs> um. See I don't know if we want lots of like, yeah, with Beck Hewitt. Yeah, oh, that's right. That? Yeah, he does too. Yeah, he's, old, that... old chick from uh, Home and Away. Yeah, yeah, she she Beck was alright. Be... Was she a singer? singer? Was she? No, yeah, well, she's, she's an actress. A... She's an actress. actress. I know that much. Yeah. She might sing. I don't oh, know. She was, home, she was on Home and Away. Yeah. And and she did do one song. There you go. Apparently. There you go. So, so we do want to finish up this one and then do just some trivia or something or what? Whatever. I don't know. <laughs> All right. GG. GG. That, that was game about 10 minutes ago. <laughs> um, righto. I'm Smithy. And I'm Murray. And I'm Butts. I'll see you probably not ever again. <laughs>